Hello everyone. On today's video, I'm going to show you guys some recent TTM returns. So let's get started. So the first one is postmarked from Miami, Florida. It took only seven days to be returned to me. And the person signed three of three. And that person would be Mr. Bruce Armstrong. Now, Mr. Bruce Armstrong played 14 seasons, all with the New England Patriots. He was drafted in the first round in 1987 out of Louisville. He was a six-time Pro Bowler, two-time second-team All-Pro, and his number 78 jersey is retired by the New England Patriots. He played in 212 games. Now, the scorecard that I'm showing you right now, um, he must have replaced it with one of my original cards that I sent him, which is no biggie because I, I didn't have a scorecard, so that's fine with me. That's Mr. Bruce Armstrong, who I think might make it to the Hall of Fame one of these days. So the next one is returned from Denver, Colorado. It took 12 days, and it's one of one. And that is Mr. Steve Atwater. Now, Mr. Steve Atwater was actually a quarterback and switched to safety at the University of Arkansas. He was an All-SEC three times, and he was an All-American twice. He holds the school record with 14 interceptions. He was drafted in the first round in 1989 by the Denver Broncos. He finished second in Defensive Rookie of the Year voting in 1989. From 1990 to 1996, he was voted to seven consecutive Pro Bowls. Speaking of Pro Bowls, he was an eight-time Pro Bowler, a two-time first-team All-Pro, he was a two-time Super Bowl champion, he was voted to the 1990s All-Decades team. For his career, he had 1,180 tackles, 24 interceptions, and 5 sacks. And I believe Mr. Atwater someday will make it to the Hall of Fame. Because he was just that good. When, when he tackled you, you went down. That's all I have to say. Now, the third one is from Phoenix, Arizona. It took 11 days, and it's 101. And it's from Mr. Herm Edwards. Now, Mr. Edwards, he played 10 seasons as a defensive back. He had 33 interceptions, and he was also a head coach. He coached the Jets, the Chiefs, and he's currently the head coach at Arizona State. And Arizona State is this season is currently four and one and ranked twentieth in the college polls. Now he is most known for, as you can see by this card, for the miracle at the Meadowlands. Uh, if you guys haven't seen the video, um, go back and check it out. Um, he basically scored a touchdown when the Eagles had no chance of winning the game. I mean, zilch. I don't know the, what happened, but we all do it. We all have brain farts. And on that day, the quarterback for the Giants had a brain fart, decided to try to hand it off. It didn't go so well. Mr. Herm Edwards picked it up, ran it back for the touchdown. End of the game. Eagles win. So that's Mr. Herm Edwards. Now, I want to thank Mr. Herm Edwards, Mr. Steve Atwater, and Mr. Bruce Armstrong for returning those cards back to me signed. I really appreciate it. I also would like to thank you guys for watching the video. Just remember, keep collecting, keep searching for those hidden gems, and keep having fun. Later.